I'm Nathan Savano and I'm the lead youth worker at the East Madison Community Center. Marking a straw so that the kid won't put their mouth on the wrong end. And we start Science Club at about 4 o'clock Fridays. Uh, today the kids are going to do a bubble project. Andrew and Kennedy, they come out. Buddy, you ready for science? I'm Andrew Deneu and I'm a sophomore at UW-Madison. We're doing some bubble. My name is Kennedy Johnson. I'm a sophomore at UW-Madison. Yes, So that's part of the ARMS program, so that's um, Adult Role Models in Science. And basically it's a mentorship, so people go to centers, schools, and are teaching science lessons to students. Why do you think your hands have to be what? We try to get the kids to think more. We don't necessarily want to tell them the answer or give them the answer, so by asking more questions, then they can kind of creatively or more critically think about it. Hey, look at this! Oh! They believe that they can do science in the future. That was cool. And some of them even want to become scientists, they've told me, and they would have never thought that a year ago. Just popped off, but we can start over. really see the impact that we've been making on these kids. It's great. The bubble's gonna break, you gotta get your hands wet. Just a smile, I see a lot of smiles. I see them not thinking about what's bothering them, and they're just exploring. Let me try to transfer it. Let's transfer it! I like science and reaction. Okay, so you're gonna use these tools, develop a lesson plan. So the course that I teach, Engage Children in Science, gives these university students all the tools they need to go out and lead science for kids. Let's try the buzzer. <laughs> it does. So my class really helps to teach them how to work with young people, oh, yeah, yeah. what's important to young people, how they learn, how to uh, build community in a group. So those kinds of things, as well as how kids specifically learn science and how kids think about science and how, as leaders, they can help them to think like scientists. Like having them act out the circuit. Having them but it's also not just about learning information, and I think that's a misconception that many people have about science, is that it's learning a lot of facts that people already know. But the exciting thing about science is learning things that nobody knows and asking questions that nobody knows the answer to. And so by encouraging kids to ask their own questions and play with materials to try to answer those questions, that's really engaging them in science and what science really is and is more like what scientists do um, than just learning a bunch of facts. And so I think the hands-on experiences are the only way to really engage them in real science. Yeah, that's the, okay, so then we can add water. With the ARMS program, you are set up with a site supervisor who is trained to help teach if they needed to. Nate is so great and everybody loves him here. By us like showing him that he can go on days that maybe Andrew and I can't come, he can teach it to them. And by him spreading it, it's showing that he's excited about science, the kids get excited about science, and other kids get excited about science. I like science and I love, I love what we do. Science. You think a fan would work? Beautiful. When you said science, they said, Nate, you're going to go and do the science thing. I'm like, ooh, science? <laughs> so, I mean, but it's been, it's been real fun. I think that's our, our overall goal, is for them to see many adults in their lives as adult role models in science, whether it's this UW student who comes into their classroom once a week, or their after-school leader, or their classroom teacher, or their parent, to really build the capacity of all those people to lead science experiences for those kids. We have right now 30 science clubs. Each of those has about 10 to 20 kids that participate from week to week. So we figure about 600 or so students, third through fifth grade, that we reach every week throughout the school year. See where it pops on your arm. Right there. Wait, did you see that? I mean, putting this type of program in, in, in the community and leaving us with the resources so we can do it after this is done is just, it's just great. I think the UW is doing a great job. So it's getting them to think about science now and think about doing something with their life that, and show them that it's fun. Thank you for, you know, bringing me here.